Scott, commiserations. Just how difficult is that one to take for you at the moment? Yeah, it's a difficult one, to be honest with you. So, um, just a poor 15 minutes, to be honest with you, Greg. Get our, some, get our nose in front. I thought the game ebbed and flowed a little bit at that point until our goal. Um, and then, yeah, I, I mean, I'm disappointed with the way the way then it obviously it, it goes in, in that sense. Uh, they get themselves back in the game at 1-1 um, and they're just easy goals, really. Just easy goals, silly goals. Um, and that's let us down today, to be quite honest with you. So that's disappointing. How has it got away from you from that position, bearing in mind the importance of this game and the opportunity mm. that was there for you at that point? Well, yeah, I've got, I've got my, I've got half an idea, but at certain moments in certain games, you need to understand where, where, where you are as a team and what your game needs at that certain moment. We just didn't, we didn't manage that situation very well. And sometimes in football matches, um, you need, you need a grit, you need an understanding, you need to be horrible, you need to, you need to play the game territory, you need to, you need to understand that. Look, I, I think it's clear to see the way my team play and the way I want us to play, but certainly there's, um, there's always two sides of a football match, and even more so now you get to eight games like we've got to, and you get your nose in front here with 15 on the clock, really, you need to, of course they can get back in the game, and they did, but at that point there's one point, we, we're walking away here with one point, and we just... We were sloppy in them moments. In the end, is it game management and simply game yeah. management that's yeah, costed you, do you feel? I think it's game management. We, we manage the game at certain moments, but there, need, there, need, there needs to be something a little bit more at them moments, and we, we lack that today. Um, I always, it's a young team, and we understand that, but it was some naive, silly mistakes, really. And, you know, at, at this moment, where we are, where, where, where we are in the season, and where we are as, as a team, you, you need to eradicate them, really. So, um, overall, disappointed. Disappointed with the loss. I always say you can lose football matches. Of course you can. But some, there's a way to lose football matches. And I just, I wasn't pleased the way we lost today. Scott, <clears> looking <throat> at positives, to what extent did Mitrovic justify your selection in him today? He was on the, he was on the, on the score line. Just a real shame that his goal ain't, ain't got a stomach out of the game, really. I thought his all-round play today was very, very good. Um, and like, like I always say, centre forwards, they, they live and die on, on, on their goals. So his finish was, was clean and, and, and was very good. So, yeah, no, he's done, he done very well today. In the bigger picture, how important is it to have him back and in this kind of form, do you feel? Well, of course it is. Look, it's been clear this year for us. We've struggled at that end of the pitch. It's been clear for, for some time. And um, Mitro now with, with Josh Madger are, are the two recognised forwards we have. And amongst them, you know, we need them to score goals. And, and, and it's, I'm, I'm pleased. That, that Mitro is, is, is that person, like I always said, what's going what's gonna to help us, really. Losing Adamola Lookman right at the start of the second mm. half couldn't have helped things. What happened? How is he? Uh, yeah, he just felt his hamstring a little bit. And I don't know where, how bad it is. We'll have to look at that tomorrow. Of course, that wasn't, it's not ideal, but that's not, that, that wasn't the reason. Of course, it wasn't. You know, we get our nose in front. So, um, yeah, we'll have, to, we'll have to see our ideas tomorrow. Scott, the very obvious question now is with seven games to go, how on earth do you pick those players up easy, from this today? Easy, great, easy. How do you do yeah, that? Easy. That's not. Disappointment today, of course it is. Um, put ourselves in an unbelievable position. And along this journey this year, I often say there's bumps. Today is a bump. How we react to these these times um, are the most important things to how we're going to do do this year. And I think we've proven that throughout this season. There are times we've had many bumps along the way and we've regrouped. We've worked even harder. We try and eradicate the mistakes we're making and try and learn and grow. And that's not going to be any different come tomorrow morning when we get up and get into work. Be brutally honest with ourselves today. 15 minutes, for the last 15 minutes, we wasn't good enough individually and as a team. But ultimately, there's seven games left and there's everything to play for. How quick we can bounce back, regroup, become stronger. And now a massive game on Friday, but there's going to be every game was massive and there'll be more bumps. You will stand here in, in a few weeks time and you'll say exactly the same and we'll have, we'll have some moments. But I also believe that we'll have, we'll have good ones as well. Scott, appreciate your time. Thank, Thank you, Greg. Cheers.